Hi, this is Rob, and today I'm going to show you how you can use Shotgun's new Hero integration to get a project up and running in no time flat. I just created a new project, and I'm going to go ahead and launch Hero through the Pipeline Toolkit. Here in Hero, I'm going to import a Final Cut Pro XML. That's the cut from a client. Let's go ahead and take a look. All right, I'm going to do a little Hero project file setup to get this up and running. All of this is your standard hero setup that you would do for any shot. Now that I have my clips renamed for my shot naming convention and I know that I'm working on sequence 100, I can go ahead and save this using Shotgun's Project Aware save dialog that knows what I want to call my files and how to version them up. Now let's go ahead and tag up this file so we know what kind of shots we're dealing with. Let's start by calling out the shots that are ready to start. In addition, I want to use a couple markers to call out the different kind of work that's going to happen on these shots. I'm going to use red for something that's going to have you know, something a little more effectsy going on. Let's get this into Shotgun. I'm going to bring up the standard hero export dialog, and we've got something new in it. That's the Shotgun shot processor. The bottom of this is exactly like the built-in hero shot processor, but up top they've got some new GUI that lets you take tags in Hero and map them to shot statuses in Shotgun and task templates so you can control what tasks are going to get created for different shots. I've got all of my standard statuses already set up and because I used a green and red tag I can go ahead and map those to a different set of tasks. Down here we've got our shot structure that's going to be created in a pipeline friendly way and I can quickly adjust the cut to include 15 frame handles and to start on frame 1001. Let's go ahead and let that export. All right, now that that queue is finished exporting, let's see what this looks like in Shotgun. Over here on my project page, I've got an updated stream of all of those versions for the plates being created in the little media center so that we can go ahead and quickly see everything that's come in. I'm going to jump over to the Shots tab because I want to see the shots that got created. Over here, we can quickly jump to a shot and see the history of everything that's happened. We can see we've got our cut updated, our statuses updated, all of that information coming over from Hero. And let's jump over to the schedule. You can see we've got all of the different tasks for our shots already created. Let's say that for shot 30, I'm going to go ahead and assign this to an artist. And let's take a look and see what we want him to do. All right, up here, let's go ahead and say we want to replace this uh, barrel. Shotgun is going to capture that image, upload it along with a note, and associate it with the task. Now let's see what that looks like for the artist. In the inbox, we see we've got a new task that's been assigned to us. I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into new. And because Hero has already exported a script for us to start with. We can quickly navigate there using the pipeline toolkit to take us directly to where our work is. Open that up and start comping. And there you go. We've got a project up and running in about five minutes with a coffee break in between, just waiting for Hero to finish that export. Thanks a lot. And as always, send feedback along. Let us know how we're doing.